that an ace? Ace first game? Oh, baby. So, I tried to do this earlier on in the week. It didn't come out too hot. I think I landed on Sunday. I tried to do this Monday. It's Thursday now. Let's talk about the Type 62. So obviously, they changed the BR at it. It was introduced as a 5.7 on the US server and the EU server. I think the Asian server got it as a 6.0 with heat. So we got a 5.7 without heat. This is a fast tank. It has a slow rotating turret and absolutely no armor. So what happened is people complained. They wanted the version with heat. So it is raised to a 6.7 now, and it does fire heat. Now, these are obviously all opinions of mine, uh, but the heat round is trash. The tank is all right. It's a fun, challenging tank to play, but I liked it better at 5.7. Hear me out. At 5.7, you had to use the T-34 rounds. These, they're pretty similar to the round on the T-34. So they don't have a ton of pen, but they do have a lot of explosive mass. And when you hit an ammo rack with one of those APC or APBC, whatever they're called, AP rounds, uh, it would explode. The thing with the heat rounds is they're 85 millimeter heat rounds. They're small heat rounds, and they don't have a lot of explosive power. Now, it might say that they do, but all heat rounds technically have a lot of explosive in them. These rounds are so small that they don't detonate ammo racks like normal heat rounds, conventional heat rounds. And there's, there's a time and a place for everything. I know it might seem like I use only heat rounds because they're easy and whatnot. That's not why I use heat rounds. I use heat rounds because if you're going to get a 15 kill game, which I did a couple weeks back, you're not going to do that using APDS and the Leopard. You're only going to get it using heat, really. If you do it with an APDS or Hesh, maybe, it's going to be a very fortunate game for you. I'm not saying it's not possible, but nine times out of ten, you're going to run into one or two tanks, at least, that you will have trouble fighting without heat at 8.0. At 6.7, it's a little different. Heat is a very different meta at 6.7 because you fight tanks like Tiger 2s, which have ammo racks that are hidden. Um, the Tiger II, if you look at it from the front, let's say you're frontally engaging this, you have to get through a lot of armor, but you can with 300 millimeters of pen. But then you have to hit the ammo racks, which are pretty hidden. You know, like they're in the right or left side of the, uh, the tank. They're not really in the turret if this guy isn't carrying as much ammo. And it's going to take you, even if he's hold down, he might get hold down or something like that, it's going to take you three or four heat shells just to kill that tank from the front. So while you do have the ability to pen, you don't have the power to one-shot it from the front. So that's the thing with this tank is they raise the BR, and you still have to do the same thing that you had to do at 5.7 with this tank anyway. So it's mine as well, like, in my opinion, I wish they just kept it at 5.7 and didn't give it heat, and it would have been fine. Now, I was one of the people who complained and said I wanted heat, but after playing it, I really, really don't like it. So we're going to take it out try to get some decent games, but it's going to be very difficult, I'm telling you that. So there might be a lot of deaths in this video. Again, I'm very sick. I had a lot of busy stuff going on today. I just got the dog back. I feel a little bad that he's just chilling at the house, but he's going to get acclimated, and then we'll go out later on today. I feel like trash, and it's hard. But every time I breathe in, I want to cough. So we'll see. We'll see how this goes. All right, so one thing you'll notice is I do have Boris's sound mod on now. I might do a separate video on that at some point later on but uh, the tank sounds might be a little bit louder than usual. A lot of people, I get comments, well not a lot, but I get comments about uh, my voice in these videos and don't think I don't know that. So I gotta, I gotta figure out a way to like make myself louder. Well, let's talk more about the Type 62. So it's not a terrible tank and it's actually pretty damn good in sim. But the reason it's good in sim is because being spotted is less easy. You know what I mean? You don't get spotted as much in sim. So you can hide the tank a lot more. Gunner transmission. Let's try to put a shot into his ammo rack. Alright, we got him. Nice. So you can still pull out stuff like this. You know what I mean? It's not an era, a terrible tank. 
but at the same time, just that the armor profile and the increased BR, it does make it a little bit more difficult to play in my opinion, at least in RB. Oh my god. I really do hope I get a good game. This sickness is coming out today. Um, I'm sure you guys have all been sick before. So it's like, it's this is the day where the coughing and the sneezing and the blowing snot all comes full circle. Oh my god, that was amazing. This gun sound, these gun sounds are amazing. This is my first full game with it. They sound so good. There's a tank on that corner. Don't look at me, don't look at me. I think he's looking at me. Yeah, he wants to kill me, I think. Terrible shot. Oh, he got hit though. Nice. Thank God. What if that tiger E is still over there? Now, there is something to note about the transmission on this tank that I've noticed, and it does like to jump forward so doing the shoulder peeking I don't know if you notice it but like like it doesn't stop on a dime you have to be in like the right gear it feels weird Ooh. you see that yeah it just did it again I'm not doing that on purpose so I don't know if that's me like I don't know if it's me I guess it could be let's try to push up though Cross. some more tanks around here somewhere. Let's cross this right here. I think he's to the left of this building. What is that? A Kugel? No, it's an awesome. I'm just gonna sit and wait. I can't get away with killing him right now.
I loaded AP though, luckily. What is over there? Only the loader. Terrible shot. I don't know if I like this sound mod, actually. Do you guys like it? I think it sounds pretty good. I feel like it's better that I don't have to talk the entire time. You can kind of just sit back and listen to the, the sounds. It's all new to me. Oh. Let me take out this seat. Okay, okay. Got the panther. Let's get this warble win. Only is the gun depression to hit me. Got him. Is that an ace? Ace first game? Oh, baby. That's awesome. That's the end of the game. So, this tank can definitely work, but you have to play the sneaky part. I don't think I'm going to play any more games in this thing because I will have to make a death touch. I can guarantee it. This, this was a lot of luck in this game. I would say you usually don't take this tank out and go that good right away. Because I, I did play it again, like I said in the beginning of the week, and it was a lot more difficult for me. But that was a good game. I mean, that was, that was a good game. So I hope you guys enjoyed this short little video about the Type 62. I hope you understand that I'm sick and that I can't put my all into it right now. So like, <coughs> not that I can't put my all into a video, but what I'm saying is I don't have the, I can't just sit here and play right now. I really can't. It's uh, So I'm very fortunate that I got a good game. What I want you to do is uh, comment down below and talk to me about the Type 62. How do you feel about it? How do you like the BR changes? Do you enjoy it? Um, if not, uh, let me know why. And we could have a little bit of a discussion in the comments down below. I do have a video or request series coming out tomorrow that I took a comment from Frank. So, Frank, thank you. You don't have to comment it on this one. I did take that. Your most recent request I did take. I like the idea, and I think it's going to be a great video. So I appreciate it. But yeah, uh, everything else will be all Gucci. So maybe I'll be back in the office later. I don't know. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys soon. Peace.